Hello everybody and welcome back to Baldur's Gate 3 where as as before, as below, above, or whatever, I miss Gust of Wind. I do miss that spell. Alas, I have no wizard anymore. I'm trying to think if anybody else would have I one that. like that. I keep thinking it might be nice to bring Halston out instead of Will for this, maybe? But Will is important for Baldur's Gate itself. I realize too, like, I'm sort of like, it's like, oh, you've been invited to the inauguration, so it's weird that I'm like... Heading out. Oh, I'm Will. Uh, I'm that it's mind. like, oh, I'm actually, in like, it. in real life, you'd be like running Should over, right? Step. To be like, oh, geez, we gotta, we gotta stop it or something. Um, but in game time. I think I can take as much time as I want, although it might screw over... Private word would be nice. Might screw over, um... Duke Raven Garden even you. more. Anyway, uh, Halson's druid forms are really useful, I feel like. He can fly around, figure stuff out. Oh, hello, you have something to say? For a while, after the Shadow Curse was lifted, I felt hope in a way that I hadn't felt in years. Yeah? I thought that nature would heal and balance between it and civilization could be restored once and for all. Oh. Yet since we neared the city, yeah. I've seen more and more signs that I was being naive. Refugees, orphans, the downtrodden, all being left behind. Has he been in the city yet? If such sorrows are the fruits of civilization, perhaps there can be no true balance between it and nature. Maybe I haven't brought him in. I I, sometimes, I, I would assume that these would come up like in conversations in camp, but apparently sometimes you have to bring people out, which does make sense, but it's also like, meh. I mean, as a former nature paladin, I feel like of such sorrows are the fruits of civilization. Perhaps there can be no true balance between the nature. That's kind of what I feel like. But I think I want to be cautiously optimistic. A temper if it's like, oh, a temporary crisis, but that's naive, right? Because this doesn't just stem from a crisis. Like, there's been poison seeping through, and only now... Is it like m being more visible? It's been given more of a platform, you know? Uh, so I don't know. Maybe I'll go pessimistic. Perhaps you're right. I hope not. I truly do. But the signs say otherwise. That poor girl, Yena. This city will devour her as sure as any wild predator would do. Be it through malice or just neglect. Her fate will be sealed by this place. We'll help her. Society should be judged based on how they treat their most vulnerable. Uh, yeah, you would think. Baldur's Gate may deserve harsh judgment from what I've seen so far. Um, I think Yenna is the girl that we have in our camp. What do you think can be done to help? This is interesting. I wasn't sure he'd have such a strong opinion, but I guess a nature druid who's been kind of out of the world for a long time, or like in the world rather, and not in like cities, you know, he's been in nature. This would be difficult for him. What do you think could be done to help? I wish I knew. Truly. A problem for another day, perhaps. I just hope there is another day. I should definitely try to bring... At least we took Yenna yeah. in off the streets. But there are many more out there. Um, so he's definitely bleeding hard. Like, he is bleeding hard to the max. I'm glad I didn't take him to the circus. He would have disliked that immensely. Um, but dang. Yeah. And he has a soft spot for children, I think. Like, especially, like, with, you know, the whole situation with the girl, Arabella, in... The druid thing where he's like really mad that the other druid woman tries to hurt her. I mean, I think that, but then there's like all these blood and guts. Kind of like someone was thrown onto like a temporary 
like spiky thing. Wow, is that a ghost ship? No, I don't like that. <laughs> okay, let's see. <laughs> that scared me so bad. <laughs> oh, that scared me. I guess I could, um, on this one, I can throw stuff on it. Haha, -ha, okay, paper doesn't work, but solid books will work. Anything up here? Oh, it cleared the whole thing? Okay. Ah, yeah, yeah. There's a trap. Let's see if Gale can do it. I would like to leave us a, a clear exit. I mean, go up this way, but... I think we also... Do we get some XP for that? Right, or does Gale get some XP? Okay, <laughs> that scared me again. Be careful not to trigger that thing. Gale is just a little guy. I mean, I, I, I keep thinking of him as a wizard, but I'm like, he's not designed for this, but, like, he's doing fine. Color me curious. Yikes. I've got a long road ahead. Okay. Lots of people glowed up. Any. And none of them. Oh, that guy is headless. Look at that. Oh, eh. Why can't I necromancer anybody? Can I necromancer the headless corpse? The corpse has nothing to Jack, say. I figured you couldn't, but like, it's, it gave me the 100% to go. Corpse too damaged. <sighs> See, if I was in the one game where I could feed body parts to my elven companion and she could tell me what happened to them, these body parts would be great. Oh, I separated us all out. Ah ha! Do not make me do this by myself, whatever it is. Thank you for the off. <laughs> it's still warm. Yeah, I know, I've been poking the body and lifting it up, and only now do you notice? Wild. How come this didn't blow up? Little puny bridge. That same ship was at Moonrise Towers, if I'm not mistaken. Was it? Are we doing more ship stuff? Divinity 2, is that you? What was I supposed to tell the leader guy? I don't know, but they're all dying. What? We're just gonna shout insults at each other. This looks like a smuggler situation gone wrong. What is this glow? This is the this is the evil glow that was at Moonrise. The like corruption, right? The shadow blight. I thought we cured that. Maybe it's a good idea that we brought Halson. Actually, that's pretty wild. I knew I had a feeling. Hmm. So, can I, like, look at other things, or do, like, I have to get involved in this? Looks like those two are about to fight. Yeah. Okay, well, we're gonna go over here. Nope. Nobody <laughs> messes with the Stone Lord rattling. Nine Fingers sent her love, asshole. Your Stone Lord's a dead man walking. You, help me kill these asses. The girl will sprinkle you with gold. Um... Can't we just get along? Must we really fight? Are you serious? Yeah. A pacifist in Baldur's Gate. <laughs> Nobody's leaving this place alive. Cock. Okay. Well, now you're all dead, and you got a sick. He's got a. He's got a sick uh, hammer. 
Am I on? Am I everybody's enemy now? Okay, so being a pacifist did not do me well at all. Hmm. I could have said I prefer not to get involved. Also, I'm not gonna pick a side, but I don't know. They're probably both bad. Jimmy on the guy. Jimmy on the guy. Crunch. <laughs> <clears throat> yeah, I mean, you guys don't have a lot of health. I'm very powerful. Oh, but at least they'll attack each other, too. Hmm. Should we? Yeah, we should. Let's do this. Because Karlak has um, a chance to not, a pretty good chance to not go prone. The guild are I don't even know who the guild is. Unless it's the Slaver's Guild, in which case, screw you. You know? Oh, come on. They are all very dexterous. Where'd it go? Where'd it go? There it is. Oh, my God. Does he still? He still has his concentration going. Ha! -ha. Do we not have equip your dang nap staff, Gail? For the stone. <laughs> For the stone lord. <laughs> Didn't even finish what he was saying. Um light on my feet. Scratch. Maybe I should have Scratch walk around with this, but I just don't want Scratch to get injured. That's my my big worry. Per short rest, I mean Maybe if I was in the middle of enemies, but I don't wanna do it right now. Oop, nope, wrong. Oopsie daisy. I do love doing that. Oh, I was like, dang, nabbit. Oh, are we, do we still have the passive on? I don't think we intentionally have the passive on. And I didn't think that's what... Yeah, you can daze them. I didn't think you could knock them out, though. Oh, but she might be important, maybe? Oh, you also rage. Sick. But she rages eagle. You would do better to, like, try to move elsewhere. For sure. I guess I could have him go up and try to knock them all over. Oh, no. Not also you guys. See if I can. Oh, sick. Oh, whoops. We accidentally killed her when we could have kept her alive. Well, she the game even knocked her out for me, I think. Tee hee. Or maybe it's when you get him down to one? Oh, well. What? Why did his... Oh, the hunter's mark did damage to him? Oh, no. So it's not still sleeting, but it is still icy. Excuse me? Our ranger? In today's economy? <laughs> I was wondering what that would do. Uh, I mean, I knew what it would do technically. But it inflicts color spray, and it is it is a small rocket, and uh, that was funny. No, please, I was gonna let Halson. Oh, okay, that's fine. I was gonna let Halson transform. Gee. Oh yeah, they're fighting each other. Whew. Okay, Halson, let's transform into. Ooh, wait, wait, wait. Oh, I don't think does he not. Oh, he does. A water myrmidon or a fire one. I want to try it. 
or an air one? Let's do an air one. Whoa! Oh, that is so neat. He can go invisible. A raging vortex. Oh, your foe with your lightning infused flail and stun it. Yeah. Oh, what? Oh, but I like to find the water. I didn't think it would hit the water. Take that. But I'm floating, so he can go. Or he's floating, so he can. Did I say old great guys? That's so funny. Good to electrocute melted water. Ow! Do I? Okay. Oh wow, she's got a lot of health. Uh, doesn't grant additional benefits. Okay. Well, geez, apparently this is just gonna be really sucky. Is what it's gonna be. I don't, are you still in the, you're not in the, okay. Are you serious? I think this will still take moonlight damage. Moonlight fairy damage. And we aren't in. is stunned. I do get advantage against him with this. Ooh. I'm kind of wondering if I don't kill him. Here, yeah. Sylvanas, let me strike with with magic if he will if I'll be able to talk to him. Oh yeah, please try to push the air elemental. Thank you for letting me electrocute the water again. Yeah, you should take a butterfly damage. That guy is annoying. Go get a gale. Um, actually, let's do. Let's try and do go away. Where is it? Banishment. Yeah, it will break. Yeah. 70% chance? Yeah. Send <gasps> oh, no. It will provoke. Well, I need to send somebody after. Okay. Oh, but she is. Oh. Okay, I just can't send her in there because right now with this cloak on, she's susceptible to electricity damage, and that is bad. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. I keep almost clicking the wrong thing. Could you stop? Could you? I, I am right here. Woman? Why? Oh, I should try to hit him. Did you pass out or die? Okay, you died. She didn't die initially. I don't know. I don't know what that was about. I've never had some. Uh, I think I, I think I did knock her down to one. She had six health left, and I hit her for five, and she fell over. And I was like, oh, did she die? And she didn't. I assume she was somebody important. <laughs> but she attacked me, so. Don't kill Gale. I don't want to deal with resurrecting him again. You're the last one, bucko. Well, it certainly is time Hatched for up. a short rest of Pushing some sort. Oh, oh well, again. let's cast. I wonder if she was like an undercover agent and I killed her. <laughs> Oopsie. The corpse regards you. 
lifelessly. It was an accident. Uh, what were you doing here? Seizing their hole for nine fingers. What were they here for? Don't know. Something valuable. The stone guy was the guy, like one of the stone dudes, was it one of the guys, the guy at the front who's dying and wanted me to tell his boss, like, oh no. Who were you fighting? The Stone Lord's men. Interlopers. Who is the Stone Lord? Fury. Threat to everyone. Okay, so Stone Lord bad. Who are you? Fallen from the guild. Who the guild? The spell's power wanes. You can ask Alas, no more this questions. is what happens when you do rampant murder. To be fair, I tried to be tried to be peaceful about it and everybody was like, You're such a baby and I was like, look me in the eye and say that. Guildmaster's orders. Nine fingers ain't backing down, Stone Lord's pushing in at our enterprise, so she won't she wants to push back on his. Find out why this fresh faced uh, little craphead is so keen to clear a landing spot for the cult's ships. Okay, so the Stone Lord is from the absolute Okay. So while they're all jerks, at least one of them wasn't working for the absolute. He wow, that's the pretty one too. Here, I'll give that to Carlag. Do not fail. The guild has caught wind of our activities down by the river. The Stone Lord has personally requested that you see off any visitors. I have heard murmurings that your dockside crew begin to doubt the tales about the Stone Lord's capabilities. Keep our shipment secure, and he will not need to come down in person and make a demonstration. Okay. Yeah, I feel kind of bad. These people had like na like nicknames and stuff, and I'm like, tee, like I just murdered you all. Like I feel like we could have talked. Alas, <sighs> didn't happen. No traps, please. Oh, um. Sylvanus's blessing. Yeah, let's uh, dismiss your wild shape. That was pretty cool, though. I'll just see what the other ones can do. Oh my gosh, he's he's he didn't get to heal because of the what? Okay, let's see Boy. if I can... No, what no, I can't. Oh, no. Okay, Gale? Charmed, I'm sure. Charmed. Hey, Gale, please help Halston. He's about to pass out. What this do? is still not good, but... With haste. They all had cute little nicknames. And I feel bad. Mind Flayer Parasite! I wish I had a bag of holding. Are you gonna say anything, Emperor? No? Okay. Maybe they were picking up the Mind Flayer. A fossilized shell? Cool! <gasps> That's cool! Alright, well, let's see what else they had back here. Oh, more tunnel? Boy, howdy. Okay, but first I want to look at the ship. Any any notes or anything? Is it gonna damage us? I was gonna say if it does, I need to leave Halston behind. Maybe it's not this bit. More annotated ships manifest. Let's see. I miss the mundane goods. The specific unit of crates has been circled with the note pinned on top. Remind her of the Stone Lord's goods. We don't need to see the man and know he's serious about his property. Pretended to crack a crate open and look inside. Remember Norn, the white eyed loon. And then white eyed loons, we came to take him away. Take him away last time out. I didn't raise a finger to stop those gods' mad bastards, and I won't for you either. Okay, well. Three Mind Flayer parasites. Yeah. And a fossilized shell. Wow. Uh, where we've been surveying recently, we found some pretty cool fossils. Blood bank. <laughs> also, there was a... There was a... Well, grenade? Granaten. 
don't mind me just teleporting the grenade to me. Is there a way in, down, down, no, no down? If I broke this stuff, would that, I don't think that would lead me anywhere. Stuff. Gross. Well. Oh, it looks like the ship itself is not something to explore. Oh, don't mind us with a spooky ghost ship. Blood bank. I don't like that. <laughs> Are there gonna be vampires in the cave? Blah, 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 blah. And with that, we'll go ahead and call it there. Thank you all so much for watching. I really appreciate it. Really quick, I want to say thank you to my patrons, to all my patrons, including my quarter patrons. Thank you so much, Fane, for your support. I very much appreciate it. And I want to give an extra special shout out to Reese Kalito, my sapling tier patron. Thank you so much for your support. I very much appreciate it as well. And I want to give an extra, extra special shout out to Christopher, my forest tier patron, who has gone above and beyond in his support of me in the channel, and who I truly cannot thank enough. So thank you all again for watching, and I hope to see you in the next one.